What is up, you guys? It's your boy Electroflame JD in the house, back again, once again, for a beautiful, wonderful, self centered revenge. And today, people, today we are here for episode 19 of our Demon X Pacania. I can't tell you if it's 100% kills, items, or secrets because I can guarantee you right now that this is blind for me and I have no idea what is going on rather than the story the plot line of the story is thickening very 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 well. but I did some bit of upgrades and as you can see I have uh, boosters that can let me go down faster that's what that's not what we had in our previous um, previous time but if you notice that the boosters that I've got is actually from that chip where I grinded from um, one of the Colossus and uh, he was actually part of the free mission which uh, quote unquote it's a colossal immortal battle data collection that's the giant one with the big sword that destroyed me on the very first episode very 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 first episode also um, I got a new cannon. I really truly got a new cannon. I play tested it and well technically I cannot use it in the air, I can use it on land. Which this mech is technically built for land combat only. So uh, that's a railgun over there. Very very powerful. It takes a while to charge but it deals one heck of a blow. But, without saying that, let us play test it, and we're going to do the emergency dispatch over here. So this is going to be very fun. Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Orbital and its affiliated consortiums to all available mercenaries. We'd like you to join the briefing and provide any assistance that you can. An emergency situation is unfolding in the Oval Link. At this time, we are still gathering data and composing the details of this mission. Complete your preparations as quickly as possible and dispatch. The details of this mission will be updated as necessary. Briefing over. Can you believe it, Rookie? They want to put every available mercenary on this mission. That's never happened before. What's going on, Four? Roughly four hours ago, Arsenals, under the command of a certain mercenary, seized one of Orbital's most important facilities. What? Who would take over an Orbital facility? Grief. BG! But why would Grief do this? The bastard's finally showing his true colors. Apparently, he's been preparing to usher in something he calls the Dominator. What the hell's a Dominator? It's what Grief and some other researchers have been calling that giant mass of femto or buried in the center of the Oval Link. According to Grief, it will not enslave us as its name suggests, but guide us in some manner. What? How's a chunk of femto ore supposed to do that? I mean, sure. With that much raw femto, he could take over at least one consortium, maybe two. Apparently, it's not that simple. The Dominator is no delusion of griefs, but that he would rebel against humanity for its sake is just... Rebel against humanity? You disappoint me, Brigadier General. You don't understand anything. Grief. Perhaps you could enlighten us then. I would be happy to fill the gaps in your knowledge. In due time, the Dominator will reveal itself to us. This event is inevitable. It cannot be stopped. No matter what I do, the future will not change. Then why did you attack Orbital's facility? If what you're saying is true, you had no reason to do that. So I may correct the course of history without delay. Humanity must advance to the next stage as fast as possible. This is not a spur-of-the-moment decision. I have been waiting a very long time for this. What? Sorry to interrupt, BG, 
But Orbital just declassified the information on that facility's defense system. Now I understand why they were so reluctant to reveal this info. These specifications are... insane. This is clearly a violation of the treaty. Why do they need so much firepower? What are they trying to protect? Anti-arsenal weaponry. Proof that Orbital did not even trust us. I can think of a much better use for such weaponry. Farewell. Hm. Lieutenant, make that defense system data available to everyone. Right away, sir. Excellent. With this, Bullet Works will now conduct a mission to destroy that facility and take grief into custody. Squad 1 will consist of Crimson Lord, Bishop, and Johnny G. Squad 2 will consist of Falcon, Painkiller, and Bonebox. Squad 3 will consist of Drake, Diablo, and... Ha <laughs> ha! Finally moving up in the world! No. I want the rookie for this mission. BG? Are you for real right now? Why do I gotta sit this one out? You're not. I need you with me to provide logistical support. If you want me to come lay down some sick tracks on the battlefield, you should have just said so. Everyone, prepare your arsenals at once and get ready to dispatch. Talk about escalation. I never imagined we'd all dispatch for one mission. What the hell's happening to the Oval Link? If you want to know, survive this battle and see for yourself what the future brings. Yes, sir. That's what I've been doing so far, and I'm not gonna stop now. Rookie, I'll see you at the mission area. I told you, I told you, I told you the plot thickens. Grief is trouble. I'm telling you right now, grief is trouble. Luckily, we get something like 40,000 seabells. I hope it's not the end of the story, because then I'll be very, very sad. Then I have no idea what other project I should give you guys next. But I will figure something out. Don't worry. I'll figure something out. But in the meantime, let's start this mission immediately. Let's dispatch immediately for you guys. And let's hope and pray that um, we actually get far in the world. Really, truly far in the world. Approach complete. You have arrived at the mission area. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is at normal levels. Radar will not be affected. Data link shared with the entire squad through the Brigadier General's arsenal. Target facility identified. Begin the mission. As noted during the briefing, this facility is fortified by a ridiculous defense system. The main attraction is an omnidirectional laser cannon. Powerful enough to strike any section of the Oval Link's barrier. So we busted the hell up before it melts our faces off. Crude, but yes, that's the idea. Since it needs to store a large amount of energy before it can fire, that makes it somewhat predictable. In the unlikely events that you take a direct hit at this distance, both Arsenal and pilots will be disintegrated. If we bring down the defense system, Grief will have no choice but to show his face. Major, we'll engage Grief when he appears. You will attack from the front to subdue him. If worse comes to worse, you have my permission to kill him. Yes, sir. Grief. The legend himself, huh? Everyone, spread out. Begin the mission. Okay, so this is where we have to do the, uh, going one on one with Grief, huh? Uh, you can't hack it, Major. I'd be happy to take over. Cut the chat. Focus on the mission. Can you say yeah. it or not? Everyone knows you're strong, kid. But riding off the enemy like that makes people nervous about letting you handle things. I'm not riding off grief. I just really want to fight this on. A victory for Bulletworks is a victory for all of us. Didn't I tell you? A real pro finishes the job they've been assigned. No, I know. I'm gonna get into my head so hard I have nightmares Get him? We're gonna draw a grief out. We gotta deal with that cannon first. Sergeant, swap these nads, will ya? I'm going in! Kid, wait! Rookie, we're going in too! Okay, cool. I already just went in. Seriously? 
seriously need my help against this enemy? Uh, just be careful. I don't want any trouble. would come to greet me. Who will face me first? Or shall I face you all at once? Grief! He's here. All units close in. Major, engage Grief. Somebody tell me right now what the hell's going on! <clears throat> what? The Major couldn't even land a single hit? How's that- <sighs> Am I really going to lose here? After coming so far? How boring. Even the ace pilot of Bullet Works is a mere human like the rest. Submit to the voice of the Dominator, and you will transcend the limits of your own humanity. The- the Dominator. BG, you should order everyone to retreat. A foul scent surrounds us. Are you even still human? I am more human than any of you can possibly imagine. I walk the one true path. The ideal form humanity should have reached. Take your goddamn foot off the Major's arsenal! Okay... Sergeant! Huh? Major! <laughs> Did you just try to kill the kid to protect grief? <laughs> Big mistake. I... I can't lose yet. Wait, wait! I was facing down grief, then the Major attacked me, and now the Sergeant is... What's going on? This doesn't make any sense! Kid, focus! This is still a battlefield. You've got enemies right in front of you! 
I can't lose to anyone. Never. Never! Just get back, kid. Don't worry about me. This thing in front of us, it's not human. Just a big scary monster is all. <laughs> That's right, Major. I'm calling you out. Sergeant! Me? A monster? What the hell are you talking about? This is what you've wanted all along, Crimson Lord. It feels good to be called a monster, doesn't it? Won't you come with me? I have so much more to show you. More? I can become even stronger? I came to gather what I had left behind, only to depart with so much more. I assume you have no complaints, Brigadier General. Damn you, Grief. If there's nothing else, I must be on my way. I have a lot of work left to do. Bastard! Remember, Lieutenant? Someday I'll be next. Don't keep me waiting. Come and kill me. <laughs> They're gone. Grief's unit has left the mission area. Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. Screw the mission! Sergeant! Don't waste your time calling the medics. <laughs> Just get a body bag ready. <laughs> uh -huh. Come on. <laughs> Lighten up, kid. Why did you do that? Why? Because it's my duty. I'm supposed to be teaching you, kid. <laughs> you protected me to teach me? <laughs> Look at what you got me saying. Maybe now you understand what the battlefield is really like. <laughs> Sergeant, I'm an idiot. I know that. I'll never stop apologizing for it, I swear. Just don't die. Please don't die. I'm not gonna tell you to avenge me or anything. I just want you to keep living. Pretty sure I taught you that much at least. You hear me? Sergeant, please. Save your strength. Brigadier General. That mission you gave me. Did I complete it? Without question. You don't need to worry. I will always be on the battlefield. Damn right. Now I... Now I can finally go home and... See my family again. Catch you kids later. Sergeant. Sergeant! Do not forget this day. Do not forget your comrades who have fought and bled with you on the battlefield. Keep them in your memory, and you will pay your respects to the sergeant. Now, let's bring her home. I am so betrayed. I will avenge the sergeant myself if I have to. I feel so, so betrayed. Well, we still have time for one more mission. And sadly, it is only because of load shedding, but we still have time for one more mission. So, transport the artifact interference is the next one. So let's hear what Sky Union and 4 has to say about this. See you guys in the Mission briefing. 
Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Sky Union. Unknown hostile forces are preventing transport aircraft from taking off from one of Sky Union's frontline bases. Eliminate these hostile forces so the aircraft can safely take off. The situation is currently in a stalemate. Complete your preparations as quickly as possible and dispatch. Briefing over. The expression unknown hostile forces immediately caught my attention. Are you suggesting these enemies aren't immortals? We have reports of two arsenals accompanying the enemies. This could be mimicry by corrupted AI, but we lack conclusive information at this time. Well, that's worrisome. But if they aren't immortals, maybe the Western Seven are involved somehow. Though I'd rather deal with immortals, honestly. Yeah, well, we're not heading out to make small talk. Whether it's immortals or the Western Seven, we should expect to see some action. You know what I mean? Good point, Jack. Four, is there anything else we should know about this mission? Two transport aircraft are standing by at the base. If either aircraft is rendered incapable of takeoff, it will result in immediate mission failure. Must be moving a lot of stuff then. Like they're relocating the whole base or something. Defending two transports at once though, that's going to be difficult. How come other reclaimers haven't accepted this one? While all reclaimers have been notified of this mission, many have declined due to their active participation in other ongoing missions. Other reclaimers, such as the Five Hells, the Western Seven, and Panzer Crown, have yet to respond at all. I guess this one's riding on us, then. Understood. We better start prepping our arsenals. Rookie, you're coming too, yeah? If the enemy has two arsenals with them, the three of us will have the numbers advantage. Jack's right. I hope you'll join us for this mission. Take... So yeah, I'm gonna accept this mission, not a problem, because apparently we'll be fighting the Crimson Lord, hopefully very, very soon as well. But we'll see what happens, we'll see what happens, we'll see what happens, we'll see what happens. Approach complete. You have arrived at the mission area. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is near zero. Radar will not be affected. Initiating e- those are the transports we're guarding. Now to find those enemy arsenals. Whoa! Hey, what's the big idea? You could at least greet us before you start shooting. The enemy force contains two arsenals. Wait a minute. Oh, I was so sure that would hit you! Why'd you have to dodge it? <laughs> oh, heaven. Because I don't want to die, obviously. What's the matter with you? You talk too much. I should kill you. It's not Immortals or the Western Seven. It's the Five Hells. What's going on here? How should I know? Just keep these ladies the hell away from the transports. Move out! Ah! Do you have any idea what you're doing? You know Savior would never involve himself in a battle between consortiums. Of this? What's this guy talking about? They're trying to destroy the transports. Just as our lady sister said. If we wait here, bad people will appear to attack the aircraft. Bad people should die. We're bad people? You've got it all wrong. We can talk this out. Bad people, good people. It doesn't matter. In the end, everyone dies. This is way too deep for me. I'm just gonna listen to my lady sister and break you all. <laughs> No use, Notes. We're gonna have to use force to put them down. I'm gonna have to go up in the air. And at the same very same dang time, I have to defend this. Okay, you guys do not fire. Okay, I can't do this one. Heaven, Abyss, what are you doing? Are these battle not Savior's enemies? No, we're not enemies. Ask Savior, he'll tell you. They keep saying that. Because they're lying. That's what bad people do. But they just won't break! Have you two forgotten what I taught you? Uh, but I don't like doing that. Do 
you want Saber to hate you? I had this coming undone. Can't think. Can't take this anymore. My lord brother. Savior. Yeah, I didn't get the pain. There we go. Okay. Uh, Abyss! You there? Where did you go? There was no other way. But still, I don't think she's dead. You're in no shape to continue fighting. Just withdraw and... Abyss isn't dead? You don't know anything, do you? What don't I know? You're such a good girl, Heaven. <laughs> Abyss and I, we've been dead for a long time. Mission. We just lost one of ours. Attention. The enemy arsenal has self-destructed. Damage to Note's unit is unknown. The transport aircraft have begun their takeoff sequence. Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. Oh, wow. Ah! Now I want my revenge for real. What the... You made her self-destruct? Your own sister? What of it? She is disposable. Don't presume to understand our family. Disposable? Notes! You're okay! It's gonna take more than that to kill me. Can't say the same for my trashed arsenal, though. Anyway, Nemesis... You better explain what you meant by disposable right now. I don't need to explain anything to the likes of you. Hey, we completed our mission. That means we won and you lost. You sacrificed your little sister for nothing. And yet, I don't care in the slightest. Good day. You're not even going to recover your sister's body? <laughs> I don't understand this at all. I thought she was your family. You had best keep that ignorant mouth of yours closed, boy. Those girls have been dead for a long time. What is that supposed to mean? Their hearts no longer beat. Their rotting organs are replaced regularly, all so they can fight for savior. That is their way of showing their love. Yes, I used them, but I respect how they chose to show their love. What the hell kind of answer is that? I would kill Savior if that's what he asked of me. What is that, if not love? I need it elsewhere. Until we meet again. Get back here, Nemesis! Damn it! Settle down, Notes. I've already sent out a rescue request for Heaven and Abyss. Sorry, I don't know what came over me. It's just... We completed our mission, so why do I feel so... Hollow. I know what you mean. I'm sure the rookie is just as confused as we are. Who knows what she was really after? Maybe Savior can help us understand what Nemesis was saying. Either way, let's head back. Four, map a return sequence. Affirmative. Mapping return sequence. I feel so betrayed. Really, truly, I feel so betrayed. And it saddens me a lot. Is there more storyline? There is no storyline, but we just reached our 30 minute mark, guys. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as well. Like I said, the plot thickens even further. So what does the, the other team have that we do not have? First, it's grief, stealing one of our uh, members which is the Crimson Lord. Now, something is going on with Savior. I have respect for a Savior. 
he has no honor whatsoever. I can see he has no typical honor. But we will find out on episode 20. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you did, hit that thumbs up for me over there. Show YouTube you loved it. If you didn't enjoy it, you know what to do. Subscribe to the channel for more support. Hit that notification bell for when more of these walkthroughs, blind dates, plays, whatever shenanigans comes in your way. Without saying and done, guys, thank you, thank you, thank you once again for watching. Stay frosty, stay safe, stay strong, stay healthy, and remember one thing. There is a flame that burns inside of you. So ignite it and flame on. Oh, excuse me. Cheers, guys. Adios, chicks.